everyone. The angels wanted me to speak about surrendering and that takes many forms and covers many areas. So many people are working so hard towards their hopes and dreams, expressing their creativity, wanting to make their lives better for themselves and others. And it can be quite anxiety provoking and um, there can be a lot of fear and uncertainties when we start taking action in the direction of where we want to go. And for many people, it can be different areas. It can be becoming a mother or moving homes or changing your career and the angels want us to be able to have patience for kind of God's time if you think about growing things in the garden and different vegetables and different fruit trees have their own special length of time and they can't be rushed or coerced or forced at any point to grow quicker or slower you should try that. <laughs> it doesn't work. And it's the same with us. We are a plant or tree of sorts. And the, the angels wanted me to provide people with peace and encouragement in the direction of their dreams. And the angels say when you find yourself getting stuck and fearful and sitting so tightly on what it is that you want to happen and you want to make it happen now and people are not cooperating and obstacles in your way and there doesn't seem to be the money to do what you wanted to do or their people are putting you down and no one believes in you or just it can be your imagination can let you know um, all the different kinds of ways that things can go wrong and but then the angels want us to know that there are all the kinds of ways that things can go right if we get out of the way of our own negative thinking and self-limiting beliefs it's a movie that we play over and over again inside our minds where we follow thoughts down dark alleys and scare ourselves where none of it is truly real and all the things that we're terrified about and all the fears and we go through the emotions and we cry and we tell ourselves all these different stories and the angels are saying that it is only so if we believe it to be so and that there's a way to go after your hopes and dreams without getting emotionally attached to the feeling and the outcome so it's about just remembering why you're doing what you're doing and to go after everything that you want with your whole heart and to be kind to yourself and to be kind to others in the process, but not to be emotionally invested in the outcome, not to sit too tightly on your dreams, that you stunt the creativity that God and the angels have for your dreams, that things can work out for you and the right people can come into your life and things can happen in a way that you couldn't have imagined. And it's about stepping out of the way to allow the universe to truly support you in your endeavors. When we surrender our hopes and our dreams and we are no longer fearful and panicked and anxious, but we have faith that we want to do such and such. And yes, there does seem to be obstacles, but to have faith that that's okay and perhaps those obstacles are a blessing in disguise that perhaps they're part of the divine plan for you and then instead of going down the green road god and the angels are leading you on the blue road which will be even better and more wonderful than you could have imagined so the message from the angels today is to kind of get out of the way of ourselves and our our neurotic ways of thinking and to breathe into the divine timing and plan that God has for you. Take action towards your dreams, but surrender the attachment to them and 
pray for guidance and signs along the way and then have faith that it will happen. Sending you lots of blessings and abundance.